Nossa, agora ele precisa do quinto play, mano. O que que poderá ser? Não sei, mano. Que é outra? We've got Ghost once again going to be prioritizing the A-bomb site in the early portion of the round. Luminosity has held off Rap side with their own initial smoke. Boiler is not really being controlled that well, though. Neither is Porch side here. The T's themselves have their own smokes to get into this bomb site, but blocked by the CT smokes. So right now, it's domination from Luminosity with Lucas leading the charge on. He's already got three kills. We'll see if he can make it four in a moment, as Kusta is going to dive into pit to try and continue this fight, but locked into the 1v4. There's not much hope for him, and he'll be taken down again by an opper. It's Yell to find that last... Do панкейк, Do там причем запятая, да, то есть именно понятно то, что этот панкейк там вообще никуда. Вот теперь бэкграунд от команды Goose Gaming, наконец-то, уже денег совсем у ребят нет. Вот, это все история к тому, что я сегодня тоже требую от себя не говорить слово соответствовать, поэтому буду соответствовать, не поверите. Соброс остается последним. Так же падает от андроида. Ну, большинство за защитой сохраняется. Мне кажется, что Android просто... Знаете, так это... Тиммейт говорит, иди вот, вот, забайте мне, а я пойду помогу тебе и забирать Ела. Лукас один на один против Шазама. Лукас знает о том, что есть игрок в Пленте, но... Запалился. Шазам, все, он не выиграет этот раунд, скорее всего. Хотя... Время, 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 Шазам промахивается, ну, nice try, действительно. Just staring at the truck, maybe hoping that he will gain some wisdom. Instead, Oscar, very well placed. They're actually looking to dual pick him, and in fact, he only gets the legs, so Lucas will actually open up the round, and there's nobody else over towards this A site. It has to be a quick rotation. Stiko may not hit the timing here. It's all going to be about the cross. He spots out Lucas, which at least slows down the push. Now, that is actually the man with the bomb as well, so he needs to be the one to cross. Shots actually not going to be hit, so it's looking like they will be able to make themselves onto the site. The fact is, though, Stiko looking to actually peek in his opponent left blind. Another flashbang to be had, which he will be able to throw out. Yell missing the shot. They line up, but only one for Stiko. And you have to look at Rops with only 22 HP. Lucas has the chance, and well, there you go. He's up his sleeve here. The lineup's coming in. Keep spraying. There were three kills there. Potentially, he gets one and a half, and it's up to Lucas now. I'll have to channel absolutely everything he can to stand a chance of holding off this B assault. He's not in a great position for it. He already thinks players have got towards the site. He would be incorrect, but there it is. The 3K! He saves the day! And it looks like the round is going in favor. Tentando fazer eles virem para um forçado aqui no quinto round. Vamos ver o Vini levando o steel. E agora o Lucas está sozinho. Ele tem mais vidas do que os dois CTs combinados. Então a equipe da Fúria vai ter que jogar naquela situação Olha a alga do Vini, que bonita! Ele já tava com essa alga aí? Pode ser sua, Juca. Espera ele deixar a Steam aberta ali pra tu ver se ela tá Vem, vem, vem. Muda o nome, muda o nome. Muda o nome da arma. Ele não vai perceber se eu mudar o nome? Opa, o Vini. Ai, meu Deus, ele deixou o Lucas com dois de vida, cara. Ele espontou o Lucas na frente da Smoke. Ai, o Serato vai errar o spray. Equipe da LG vai garantir seu primeiro ponto. Lucas tá com apenas um de vida, Juca. Ele já garantiu duas kills nesse round. Ele tá buscando o terceiro kill. Vamos ver se. Excelente! Excelente! Smokes, there's a lot to work with here for Team Liquid. So if they coordinate things well, they'll be okay. I can see the fire doing so much damage. The takedown, Henny, Bolso facing, doesn't get anything. Two versus two now as Nekin sits on the coffins and waits for the CTs to arrive. And arrive they will. Twist with a nice swing, but they have to get on the bomb here. Oh, Lucas had to hit that shot. He hits every single bullet from the deek. Lucas and his D. É ponto da Luminosity, situação financeira complicada da NTZ. Será que temos o comeback? É, vamos ver se temos. Comeback aí, como já mencionou o crânio, enquanto isso o Lucas já solta o spray aqui no rápido, traz duas eliminações.
Consegue trazer o terceiro abate agora. O Lucas Estilega aparece para eliminar o Cello. Galera, só pedir aí respeito aí no chat aí com os companheiros. Vamos manter a ordem. Não, daqui a pouco o Ban vai cantar aí para vocês, hein? Então, vamos manter a ordem aí, sem palavrões, sem é, agredir ninguém verbalmente aí. Então, Here come the CT, Smokes up, trying to get towards the B bomb site. Initially sprays in, Lucas out towards lower tunnels, takes out Snakes, starts off on the right foot here. So aggression will come in from Grimm as he gets ready for the face back against him. Lucas not safe. First in, damage gonna be done, he takes the second kill. Over the triple, he gets them all. And that might be the dismantle that the LG side need. Brown, but there you can flash over there. If you get an inkling they're setting up, you can flash over it, but they just didn't get that sort of intel. But uh, either way, Alex, this is fast again, out towards that palace. First already out on the bomb side. Phelps is there as well. I can't believe it, and Coltera is still one HP. He is gonna burn eventually. Bolts, he's right next to his former teammate. Fur jumps and connects. Fur down towards Firebox. Now Phelps is in trouble. As Lucas is gone, and this round has gone awry for MIBR in just the blink of an eye. It's a quick adjustment from Fallen, but he can't quite connect towards Dark. And now Taco, he leaps off of Palace and finds just the first threats from all over the place, though, and that finds its logical conclusion. We have a 5 7 score in favor of MIBR on. Times so have now slipped behind. But anyway, we're going to get back into this as the pistol round is live. Good opening so far for Bad News Bears, continuing with a strong first half play here. Yeah. Oh man, the Bears are doing well. Luke is going to do his best to withstand one bullet, strafes around the corner, two plays on front. He could no do way. this. Peter's no. out there. He's whipping a couple shots. Peter can't connect, but he does just. And uh, this is just a bit weird, isn't it? Yeah, but without a kit, they're going to have to rush pretty quickly here. Nekiz is going to spot Lee's two while taking out one. Shakezilla, though, kills Nekiz. And now Lucas in one two situation. Oh, taking out Floppy there. And now he's playing the bomb. Lucas knows he probably probably doesn't have a kit. Doesn't have a a hope. Shakes all right. Did some sick damage in that round. Он также посматривает и коннектор. Заходит Молотов. А как-то далековато от бомбы нет разбежались ребята. Нет китов, но нет и гранат. Хотя если Катлер прикроет, Лукас последний. Бомба под него. Ну бомба очевидно под него. Ай-яй-яй-яй-яй, не было видно, не было видно с этого яща. Фейк по бомбе, Лукас прячется за огнем, бомба пищит, катер, ну тут уже убьет, не убьет, неважно, раунд был проигран. Скопнулся, 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 море получает вот Ну, ходит на нафа, забирает нафа, выходит на твиза, какие флюки, хэнни не видит справа за моликом так, а вот тебе и шейдеры на экране, и лишь последние ребята. Ох, ну не угадал я с кэшом, что счет будет 16-10 в пользу LG, но зато в LG на Dust 2 я не менее был уверен. И, соответственно, то, о чем я и говорил. Oh my goodness, Lucas. Oh my goodness, look at that utility damage. Oh, chaos. Oh, it's disgusting. Oh my goodness. That's gross, man. It's explosions and... In... Very important entries being made by it. And he just has to play further behind his teammates now, you know, in this position. So it's not the end of the world. And here they go, into the V-bomb sites. Running straight through, looking to peak wide. Can't do anything against pit position, though. And this has really fallen flat on his face. Plenty of time for reinforcements. Waiting for his team. They have a combined 27 HP, but it's about the headshots and a pistol run. It's all about the headshots. They've got the range advantage with the USPs. They just need to hit some jaws with these bullets, and then they're good to go. But they don't have a defuse kit, so they need to move quicker. Is it a free kill? Can he land the shot? He can. They've got to find the last player and quickly. They've got to get on this bomb fast. Lucas just waiting for his time. There's a first one. He can just dance around. He doesn't have too much area to play with, but I think he may have won the round anyway, and he certainly has now. Сегодня был сегодня сад момент сегодня уже звучит. Мы до слабее. Ah não, velho, pensa entrar na bomba, velho. Ok, viu? Isso é, velho. O cara chegou a tempo. Vai atirar cá, velho. Ô, para, velho. Ah não, velho. Ô, não, velho. Ô, e aí, velho. Lucas, seu lindo. Como é bom ver tu. Valeu, nego. Valeu, nego, velho. Para o cantinho da esquerda, Lucas. Ah, o espelho. Cuidado de ângulo aí, cuidado de ângulo aí. 
pegou não, não foi isso que ele. Você tem Liquei, Charlie. Tá de água agora, você vai ter. A bomba, Charlie, seu bosta! Ele mandou tudo, ele mandou tudo. E esse? Bacete! Bate em defa! Tá marcando meio dia há muito tempo. Cagado, né? Cagado Não quer mais? Baixa o aplicativo. Os caras trollou os hard. Aí, vocês estão trollando, hein? Vocês estão metendo louco no linha, hein? Fica tranquilo, que que eu, eu tô. Aí, aí, aí. Tomou, você viu? E tem um cara na esquerda ali, fica vendo como é que você ganha. Ó, ó. Pode chamar a resposta! Chama eu na resposta! Me dá a abraçadeira! Me dá a abraçadeira! Eu tô com a 10! Então o cara caminho de ó, caminho de rato ou CT? Tô indo bem, vamos dar. Ele tá onde? Tá no mercado? Beleza. Beleza. Você não me avisa não, Xiu? Não, você não...